Welcome to day 15 of 30 days of calculus. Today's problem is taken from page 166 and it is applicable on product rule. So you are given two functions fx and gx whose product is a new function hx. So let's write it the function individually. fx is x to the power 5 plus 13x square. Its derivative by applying power rule is 5x to the power 4 plus 26x. So f prime of x here denotes the derivative. So rate of change of x cube plus 13x square. Apply the power rule and get your answer. So 5x to the power 4 plus 26x, that's the derivative f prime. Now we take the second function, let's write gx. It is 7x cube minus 5x square plus 18. Let's take its derivative. So we are now going to calculate g prime of x, which is derivative of f g x. So d by dx of the function g x, which is 7x cube minus 5x square plus 18. Again, we are going to use power rule and write it as 7 times 3x square minus 5 times 2x. And the constant 18, its derivative is 0. So this gives you 21x square minus 10x as the value of g prime. Now the product rule says the derivative of hx, which is the product of the two function, is f of x multiplied with g prime of x plus gx multiplied with f prime of x. So let's substitute the values. fx is given, gx is given f prime and g prime we have calculated so just plug in the function and i'm putting the values x to the power 5 plus 13 x square multiplied with 21 x square minus 10 x plus gx so that is 7 x cube minus 5 x square plus 18 multiplied with f prime of x that is 5 x to the power 4 plus 26 x now you can solve this, multiply using distributive property, collect the like terms and use the distributive property to get your final answer. So this was how you use product rule for finding the derivative of product function. So get your answer.